Attention, please. Welcome, good day, and hello to Silent Time, the opportunity to think on what is really important in life. Attention, please. Attention to what? Be to an announcement in the airport or via the news? To what do you pay attention? What is important for you, especially in nowadays time, where there are so many things that we need to filter out, cannot absorb everything. You will always pay attention to one thing and neglect another thing. You get so many news, so many advertisements, so much what other people talk, and so on. What do we filter out? To what do we give our attention? One of the most silent voices is from God. He does not shout at us as other people might do, as other forces might do, as the advertisement or other things might do. God speaks silently, but he speaks. He also was speaking to Ezekiel, Chapter 3, verse 10, God said, Pay close attention and remember everything I tell you. Then go to the people. God is asking for attention. We may not hear his voice, obviously, and yet he talks to us in his word, in the Bible, in the sermon via preachers, and also in everything that happens to us every day. Good things, pleasant things, as well as challenging and difficult circumstances. In all that, God talks to us every day. Do we listen to him? Do we pay attention to God or only to other topics? In the Hebrews 2 verse 1, it says, Therefore we must pay greater attention to what we have heard so that we do not drift away from it. Let's not drift away from God. Lord, we ask for forgiveness that so many times we listen to other things that seem to be more interesting. Yet you still talk. You do not shout at us. You talk silently. Forgive us where we do not listen to you, where we set other priorities. Thank you that we can always turn to you, that you are not far. Thank you that you are still merciful. Thank you for your grace, for your help. Help us amidst all the noise and the busyness of the world, amongst all that shouts at us, still to listen to you. Help us to open our ears and hear what you have to tell us. Help us to keep your words and to store them in our hearts so that we may, may walk more closely with you. Open not only our ears but also our hearts that in all joy and in all pain we remember your word and we listen to you. We pay attention to you. Thank you for your good word, for all the good promises that you give for all the comfort and the consolation that you give. Praise and glory and honor be to you forever. Amen.